This is a dishwasher I picked up the other day. Uh, no, <coughs> it's not too bad inside, but she said it stopped draining. I'm not in the business of repairing stuff. So I'm going to uh, strip it all down. And if these trays and cutlery baskets and what have you are worth popping on eBay, then that's what we'll do. Right, first things first, we'll get a coffee. Okay guys, well, I forgot to press record and I've already started stripping it down. Look, this is the biggest motor I've seen on a dishwasher ever. I've stripped a few of these down. That is a fair size motor. Um, this stuff on the side here, if you get it off, <laughs> it does pick off. But if you get it all off, you'll, you'll get a better price. But at the moment, stainless, it's not very, uh, not very promising in the old dollar department. Why, why do the dishwashers have these concrete things on top as well? I mean, it's not like they're going to dance around. It's not like a washing machine, is it? Anyway, let's carry on. Now, I know some of you are going to say, oh, why are you taking too long doing all that? Well, it's not my main source of income, so this is just relaxing for me. Anyway, I'll get all that off, off later. Yeah! Well, that's better. Hey! 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 Shot of the pump there. Yeah, it's fair size. Ooh. Capacitor. Let's discharge that. Let's get it out of the way. Look guys, this pump kicking in is gonna continually annoy the hell out of me. And the rain on the shed. So I'm just gonna head, go ahead and scrap all this and then at the end we'll do a what have we got from it. Okay. Copper, copper, copper motors, spiders, <laughs> oh, what a mess, all right guys, it is stripped, Whew, what a job, what a mess, got all, knocked all this, I don't know, it's like tar or something off the insides, but anyway, got it off, like I say, it's not my main source of income, so I've got time, but yeah, now I've got to clear all this crap up anyway so there's the main body of it that's stainless steel that's the back of the door i've weighed them there's five and a half kilo of stainless steel there Ooh, the um the all the other steel bits um i thought I, I thought the front panel was stainless but it's not it's just polished steel those came in total would you believe it's eight and a half kilo I was quite surprised at that. Uh, the bundle of wire that came to just under half a kilo. Uh, the, this wire, I don't even know if, if it's copper. I mean, some of it might be that aluminium stuff, and it starts to rain again. It doesn't seem like it's stopped. So I'll just have to knock all these connectors off. Uh, there's the soap dispenser. Now there's a motor in there. We'll get some copper out of that. Inside here was the heating element. Uh, I don't know if I'll bother smashing that open. A few bits of circuit board, nothing to write on there. There's the water pump, and there's my water pump just kicking in. Um, there is copper in there. It's quite easy to get out, actually. Uh, it looks a bit more painful than what it is. You got all the baskets. I'm going to do a bit of research on eBay. There's the bottom spray bar. They usually sell pretty well. Um, again, the, there's the cutlery basket the leveling adjusters I have people seen people sell them but I don't know whether I'll bother but there's the best bit out of it I reckon the copper motor look at all that Ooh, lovely jubbly um, yeah power lead so I'll put them off 
put, sorry, I'll pop them off and put them towards my brass pile and do another melt video further down the line. I'll link a video up here or up here or wherever it is to my brass plug donut melt. Um, a few bits and pieces. Don't know what that is. Sorry about that guys, my lad just came in. I wanted to ask me something. Um, yeah, there's a few bits and pieces like I just, I don't know. Is, is there anything, is it worth smashing them open? I don't know. Was it worth doing this? <laughs> I doubt it, but hey, there you go. Alright guys, so yeah, is it was it worth smashing a dishwasher open? For me, probably was. Um like I say I don't do this for a living. I've got a job, this is just some strange weird hobby that I can get all my frustrations out of. Um bad bit is now though, I'm gonna clear all that up. Right, okay guys. If you've got it if you've made it this far thanks for watching um and i'll see you on the next one bye